today we will talk about the BJP and its absolute domination of social media. Digitally, there is no party that comes close to BJP because the BJP does not employ workers in the digital realm. It simply makes people want to work for its cause and ideology. Hi and welcome to TFI English, the national socio-political analysis arm of the TFI Media Group. I'm your host Purva and if you haven't subscribed to TFI English yet, please hit the subscribe button and also click on the bell icon to receive all the recent updates. Coming back to the story, I will tell you how BJP is making full use of social media platforms. So, let's begin. The 2022 state assembly elections have broken many records. Out of the five states that went to the polls, the BJP has won four, Uttar Pradesh, Uttarakhand, Manipur and Goa. For a large part of when the model of code of conduct was in force, large gatherings, public rallies and road shows were banned by the election commission. That made all political parties sweat and the BJP was no exception. This was the first election when parties were forced to move away from the traditional method of vote canvassing and fight crucial polls digitally. Yet, despite the restrictions, the BJP has managed to sweep Uttar Pradesh and retain power in three other states despite a considerably heavy load of anti-incumbency. What that tells you is that BJP was able to ace its social media and digital campaigns. Does that come as a surprise? Absolutely not. The Bharti Janata Party was the first political entity in India to realize the strength and potential of social media. And since 2014, it has only consolidated its hold over India's digital platforms. In 2019 itself, the BJP had emerged as the single largest spender on political ads in Google, social media giant, Facebook and other sister platforms of the company, spending upwards of Rs 20 crores through its official accounts. The BJP is estimated to have around 145 to 150 million followers across both PM Modi's and the party's social media handles. Speaking to Times of India, BJP is in charge of National Information and Technology Department. Amit Malviya said, BJP conducted various virtual rallies which were addressed by Prime Minister Narendra Modi, where lakhs of people were mobilized in several locations keeping the COVID guidelines in mind. The same virtual rallies were viewed by millions of people on their social media accounts and on handheld devices. Digital users in India grew by 108% from 250 million in 2014 to 520 million in 2019, which was when the last general elections were held. The usage of social media platforms grew by 155% during this period. BJP dominates what such users see and consume on their smartphones, making the party an unparalleled entity on the social media. The BJP has devised a unique strategy. The Saffron Party depends on beneficiaries of various central and state government schemes to act as ambassadors of the party. The party has tasked its karikartas to connect with such beneficiaries to enlist their support so they can become digital ambassadors for the BJP. The BJP is the only party in India that has a fan following. For many, Prime Minister Narendra Modi and top BJP leaders are celebrities. Therefore, ordinary citizens who might not be BJP workers also help the party in more ways than one on social media platforms. Teenagers and adults alike who are together categorized as the youth have become volunteers for the BJP, helping the party expand its digital footprint and taking its message across to a sea of people. These people act as catalysts for the BJP's growth. It is due to the collective power of such digital warriors that the BJP was able to overcome many challenges in pursuing a virtual campaign, especially in Uttar Pradesh. Traditionally, political parties have depended on cadre and foot soldiers alone. The BJP, however, has been able to weaponize social media to its benefit. Scores of people on social media carry forward BJP's message not because they are paid to do so, but because they want to play a role in parties' growth and continued success across India. At a time when parties are increasingly feeling the pain of an intense card crunch, the BJP is witnessing an upswing in the number of volunteers willing to work for it free of cost. In the long run, this will ensure that the BJP does not face a shortage of workers and volunteers. Most of the BJP's social media warriors are young, and they have years in hand to contribute to the party's growth across India. There is no party that has a dedicated social media ecosystem that shadows all competition. The BJP is the only dominating force of Indian social media. 
and that will be a fruitful party for years to come.